Virginia Beach Public Libraries are closed to the public, but they're still serving the community. 13 News Now reporter Connor Real gives us a peek at how they're working to help save lives. Imagine it's 2010. You just started working at your library stocking shelves. Now what if I told you a decade from now, you'd use a three-dimensional printer to make protective masks in order to continue serving your community during a worldwide pandemic? Oh my gosh, um, <laughs> I'm not sure if I would have believed you. A lot has changed for library technology program specialist Jordan Fowler and for Virginia Beach Public Libraries as a whole. It's adapted. I think we are still playing a vital role right now, even though we are closed. You know, our phones are still ringing constantly. We're answering emails all the time. Actually, we're getting more emails now than we probably were before. Even with its doors closed due to social distancing, the library is open for business when it comes to providing information to the community. But that's not all they're giving. We are 3D printing uh, face shields for first responders. And what that entails is 3D printing a visor-like piece that goes across the forehead and it has rivets on it that allow a um, clear sheet of plastic to hang down in front of the Virginia Beach thing. Library staff has started making masks for first responders using their seven 3D printers. It's incredible that we can help this way. So for Fowler, a lot has changed. I still haven't gotten over the fact that you can take like a picture of something on the computer, make it a 3D model and then print it out. Like that still blows my mind. <laughs> but some things never will. That's why I like doing what I do. I get to help people and I get to do it in a face-to-face -face way. So being able to like walk across the street and be like, here's some really cool stuff that we made to help you. Like it was a really rewarding experience. In Virginia Beach, I'm Connor Real, 13 News Now.